absolutely fantastic bit of kit. I, I can't fault it in any way at all. Um, it, it looks good. It's incredibly small. I, I still cannot get over how small it is. And the best thing for me... I mean, put it this way. I am a big PC gamer. Um, and I was going to get Assassin's Creed 4 because I'm a massive Assassin's Creed 4 fan. Um, I'm a PC. And I was humming and ahhing so much because I'm, if I played it on PC I would play it with the Xbox 360 controller as I do most of my PC games um, especially like console ports obviously um, and for the first time ever I didn't buy an Assassin's Creed game on the day of purchase because I was humming and ahhing about whether or not to get it on the PS4 so I could play it with the DualShock 4 and now I've got it in my hands um, it's worked out perfect because my girlfriend actually went out and bought it for me um, as an early Christmas present, so it's all worked out. Just um, I can't wait to boot up AC4 actually and see what it looks like because the 1080p patch is out there. So uh, it's an incredible get a bit of kit, and it's not a bad price either, is it? To be honest, here in the UK, <laughs> yeah. I mean, I had a PS, uh, sorry, an Xbox One pre-ordered. Um, and I actually cancelled my pre-order on the Thursday evening prior to release. Um, actually, I had it as um, my PS4. I ordered through Shop Two, so that was being delivered. And my Xbox One was pre-ordered through Game for in-store pickup at the midnight launch. And I, on the Thursday evening, I, I made a decision not to get it. Uh, I, I just don't think it would have seen enough game time to make it worth what is, in all fairness, quite a chunk of cash. I quite fancied it for Forza, but let's be honest, I've got my PS3, GT6 is coming out, no doubt GT7 will be out on the PS4 at some point. Uh, let's go with the Gladiator. And the only other game I would have purchased was Rise and Dead Rising 3. Dead Rising 3 just looks awful. I actually thought it looked really good, visually I'm talking graphically. But having now seen some footage of it, it just looked absolutely bloody awful. Um, and I'm a, I'm a self-confessed graphics whore, and quite a lot of my purchases are based on what games look like, which is incredibly lame. But I sort of was PC gaming back in the days of Ultima and when Doom first released and Wolfenstein. You know, I've, I've seen a lot of progression in graphics, chaps, and uh, that's part of what the hobby's all about for me. That's why I invest so heavily now on my PC. I got back into PC gaming sort of like a couple of years back. About 18 months ago, something like that, I got back into my PC roots. And of course, now I've kind of got back into it. Steam is out, and Steam is the worst thing ever for my wallet, man. These Steam sales are just incredible. I've already got State of Decay and Bioshock Infinite picked up on this batch. I quite like the look of that. Was it Shadow Run or something? That kind of... Oh, crap! How did he not get me? I was right on the deck then. I think he's just boom and zoomed me. Is he? He's right on my six, isn't he? No, there's only one thing for that. Right, ring's been clipped. Oh, I'm struggling. I'm struggling to keep her in the air. Come on, guys. I need some support here. There he is. Taking AA fire. Guy's not giving up, is it? I'm out, I'm out, he's got me. God damn it. You wish Steam had more games for Mac? Yeah, true, mate, but, you know, they have still got quite a few games for Mac, haven't they? It's not like they've completely forgotten about Mac users, so fair play to them. If, he, if that's what he was trying to do, Barry, he did a bloody good job, I tell you. That boy was all over me like a rash. 
problem is, is if the first sort of hit you take is one that really affects your maneuverability, it, it just becomes a almost an exercise in frustration, to be honest. Oh, cheeky gits! But I like rockets coming at me then. What the hell was that all about? They are, uh... Start evening up the odds a bit here, chaps, cos, uh... Come on guys, take some of their bloody grain units out, they're getting bloody massacred here man. Come on, guns! Come on, guns online! Come on! <laughs> that was close, man. Guns were reloading. Oh, cheeky! Oh, what's this boy doing? Oh, you get! I only just pulled up then. <laughs> Cheeky chap, eh? Yeah, got ya. Guns. Let's get some altitude. Adam, how you doing, mate? Long time no see, buddy. You're right, did. Yeah, I did have a fuel leak. I think it's uh, they can sort of self right themselves, can't they? Got to watch that speed. I come in out. There's boom and zoom. Hang on, let's see. Oh, you get! Did I keep it? Did I keep it? No, I didn't. What a wanker! Come on! Come on! No! Oh, what a git! There is a reward for killing other planes, Galloway, yeah. A, a, quite a huge uh, RP boost for killing enemy planes. The problem is, it's actually quite hard to get it counted as a kill, even though you can cause critical damage and all the rest of it. Until you actually finish them off, it doesn't necessarily count. I've got, I mean, I've you know, caused multiple planes to die, but my actual kill count's not that high. But I don't, I must admit, 
mean, I don't know if I play it a little bit differently to some people, but I really do want to play this kind of as a team game to win. But uh, I'm sure on the PC it's played a lot more tactically than what we're playing it. I don't know what I was doing there. Jesus, that's terrible. I just completely lost out on a whole bomb run there. That was terrible. That was truly, truly terrible. Looks like we've got. We can take out that AA. Oh, we got one. Getting a microwavable hot dog. Mmm, sounds yummy. <laughs> oh, we did get a kill with that. That's nice to know. Pretty sure we're not going to hit anything with that, but I just want to get the. Uh I wonder if you can reload the bombs. Oh, we got someone on our ass. They're absolutely destroying us. I'm really pissed now. I hate losing. My team sucks on this one, uh, Barry. They didn't do anything. Has anyone else got lag or is it just Raccoon or Recon? Come on! 20 seconds till I get my bombs up. But no chance, look. Should have gone further out. God damn it! And by the time we've got that up and running, you know what's going to happen, don't you? It's going to be game over. I'm not going to get another run. I reckon we got a couple then. Yeah. I'm very surprised they haven't just literally wiped the floor with us now because all they need to do is go and take out a couple of uh, ground targets and it's game over for us. I think we've got two teams that haven't got a clue what they're doing to be honest. Come on, take him down, Gunner. I think people underestimate the amount of punishment these bombers can take, don't they? 